Hey everyone, welcome to How Inez Rolls. Paul and I are gonna have like a little date night and we're heading to Hobby Lobby. That sounds like fun, right? Let's go. So we were told by, my, I think a couple of viewers that Hobby Lobby has some good holiday stuff. So I just wanted to come and take a look and take you along with us to go shopping with us. If you aren't familiar with Hobby Lobby, I'm not sure how popular they are around the US or around the world. Um, it is a very large like craft and decor store and it tends to have tons of furniture, furnishings, decor, things that are DIY crafting tools, material, so much fun. And I'll show you. I'm so excited. Look at all the fall. Dun, 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 dun. Oh, I love this black and white. Little baskets. Okay, so I'm gonna start looking to see how to make my own wooden garland. But that one's so pretty. Look at that. Just such cute stuff in the black and white. So a lot of these signs, guys. I know that these are a little bit bulkier, but you can get these at the Dollar Tree. Very similar. What do you What do you want to get? New welcome mat. Ooh, a welcome mat. We should look for one. These are kind of cool. They're lit. These are lit. They're lit. You guys, look how cute that is. That is so cute. See, I love the white pumpkins. They look like you should go apple picking. I do too. I do too. All of this stuff I would be looking at for things in my classroom to like switch things up. Like these would be perfect in a Montessori classroom for like pouring or using little tongs. I like had these exact same ones. <laughs> Oh, I miss it. <laughs> but Paul just found a cornucopia. And right now, look at 40% off. That's awesome. Mm -hmm. That's super cute. Mm -hmm. It's like a Viking. <laughs> Three, <one. laughs> Put right two of them together, and then you're more like a Viking it's on the side. Like... <laughs> uh, so they have that section over there with the Christmas. We're going to stay away from that. X. Not yet. Such a pretty aisle. There is so much Christmas here. Like almost too much, wouldn't you agree? Sure. Is sure. there such a thing? If I, I, I guess. I love Christmas. I do too, but I've just been so sad that there hasn't been a lot of fallout. And uh, that, that's true. They, they uh, are preemptive with it. For sure. So this is an area that I love. All these wooden items, little DIY stuff. Get pretty creative. We have so many lamps here. Some super cute ones that are different. What a good, I, good place to come buy a lamp. This such cutie stuff. Rural farmhouse looking decor. Oh, looks like I found some welcome mats. Alright, so Paul has found what he wants. <laughs> so where would you put that? The, the back wall by my grills, but the wall was here with the neighbor. Yeah, so it'll be outside in decor. Yes. Well, that's a lot of money. It's like $120. But Hobby Lobby always has coupons. So is it worth $70? <laughs> I know Paul would love it. So definitely lots of foliage, lots of fall. But I'm not seeing, seeing a lot of Halloween though. And I'm not sure if you guys know this, but 
We're big Halloween fans. <laughs> That's when we know fall has arrived. So we definitely need to go to some Halloween stores and get some ideas. Are we dressing up this year? I guess it depends on what everybody else wants to do. Yeah, we have friends that all we all get together. So we'll have to figure it out. Last year we were, I was like a, a creepy doll. And what were you dressed as? I just have like a skeleton shirt on. <laughs> okay, well, let's show you some more. We're nearly done. There's some more. Oh, those are pretty blankets. Ray Dunn. Ooh, let me know if you follow a lot of Ray Dunn stuff. She's got like this font. It's kind of like that skinny font. But these pumpkins, you guys, I think you can get them cheaper at the Dollar Tree. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if they're gonna be big, but at least these smaller ones. What's really nice about Hobby Lobby is they sell furniture too. So these little pretty tables and look at this cute sign. I love it. That's a nice little bar chair. And there's a whole area up front that has way more furniture. They have like all of this like um, material that's for furniture. I need to find some more of this thicker material to redo the outside bench. He made a couch out of pallets. These are all for indoor. We need to find outdoor. Here's a section that I know my mother-in-law would like. Lots of blue and white. Although she has a more of a French blue and white, like a toile print. Some of these things would go really nicely. Look at these pretty mirrors. Look at that one, that's nice. Nice big tall one. Paul is on the hunt for barbecue stuff. I like that, I like that eat. So this is out front, right before you enter the store. They have all of this furniture. And it's reasonably priced. It says all of their furniture is always 30% off. That's cool. Home sweet home. Is that like an entertainment center kind of thing? Go and put a TV on it or display. I do like these shelves. I like that, that's nice. And it is $2.99, okay. Ooh, I like that little lamp. Very antique-y. <gasps> and that magnolia wreath, so pretty. So this black and white is like perfect for fall and Halloween and even into Thanksgiving for sure. Look at that. So cute. So much goodness. So we just came back and I thought I'd show you what I got. This is just a, a fall sprig. In fact, I'm going to put it right in this milk jug. So this is like a, an actual antique. Um, I actually had more of them and I got rid of them. Boy, now I'm wishing I didn't. <laughs> so I'm gonna just switch that out and um, I got this. This was just a couple of dollars. It's just like a little garland. Um, I'll show you. And last but not least, I thought this was screaming fall. So all three of these things were $7, you guys. So let me show you how it looks. seven dollars right I love how the little garland is wrapped around it does have a bendable wire in there and so I have it on both the, the table and this little hutch and I'm just constantly moving things around so I'm starting to bring out some of the pumpkins now so that is super fun I hope you had a good time coming with us to Hobby Lobby 
We don't usually go there very often, but it was really nice to see all the decor this time of year. <sighs> so thanks for coming with us. Have a wonderful evening and stick around rollers. You just never know what we'll be rolling out next. Bye everyone.